notoriously rundown stretch of road in Coventry could soon be getting a makeover. The center of New England has been in disrepair for years, but as Alex Torres Perez explains, new development plans are in the works. Alex. People in Coventry tell me it's discouraging to see businesses closed down and roads filled with potholes here at the center of New England, but the town council expects all of that to change. Uh, it's been constantly in disrepair. Ralph Yuva has lived by the center of New England for almost as long as it's been there, and he's noticed the road deteriorate over the years. And no one wants to take any responsibility for it. It's impossible to find anyone who will take responsibility for it. Uneven patches of covered up potholes plague the road today, and the town solicitor says the road you see now is still from the original developer back in 1997. So for context, I think I was in first grade at Greenbush School in West Warwick. <laughs> <laughs> but that will soon change, thanks to the court approved sales of eight parcels at the center that will bring new businesses to the area. The town expects more than $500 million in tax revenue within the next three to seven years as part of this agreement. It would appear to be a win for the town of Coventry in a, in a lot of respects and puts this nightmare and quite frankly this eyesore behind us. The town solicitor says developers will use the money from the sale of the parcels to finish the center of New England Boulevard and the so-called wetlands crossover. Work could begin as soon as this August, but the timeline is still in the works. And does that give you a little bit of hope? Or? Oh, absolutely. Yep. The town solicitor says he will keep everyone updated with when that road work is expected to begin. A public town hall is also expected to go over the future development plans here at the center of New England, but it's still unclear when that will happen. Reporting in Coventry, I'm Alex Torres Perez, 12 News.